afternoon. My name is Tracy Moore, and I'm the CEO of Donate Life South Carolina. April is National Donate Life Month, and as a part of the celebration this year, we are passing on the flame of life throughout South Carolina to honor every donor hero that made the decision to give the gift of life. South Carolina is very fortunate to have the dedicated support of our state leaders. So we felt today it was perfect that on April 14th, marking midway through the month of our celebration, we will now pass the flame on to our state leaders who support our cause and are willing to share the life important and life-saving information. Now I'd like to ask Scott Allen to come up. And Thank you. I would like all of you to know, because of this gentleman and this lady here's wonderful and dedicated leadership in our state, during the year of COVID 2020, we were able to save a record number of lives because of their quick action and dedication. So please join me in giving a warm welcome to the Honorable Henry McMaster, Governor of South Carolina. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you very much. Appreciate y'all coming out to our beautiful historic state house. And um, the, the torch there is symbolic because once that flame goes out, it's out. And that's the whole point of, of what we're doing. I'd like everybody to, when you get a chance, take a look at your driver's license and see if you have that little red heart on there. And if you do, that's good. If, if you don't, then think about it a little bit. It's not for everybody, but it's a, it's a way to, for one life, to keep another life going. It's a, it's a way to, to pass that torch of life. And we, we value our people in South Carolina. When Thomas Jefferson, with the assistance of John Adams and Ben Franklin, was writing the Declaration of Independence, they talked about, the, about life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Of course, first was life, because without life, then the other two will not follow. So this is important. It's important that South Carolinians know that this is, this is a good way that you can help your fellow man, a good way you can help your neighbors, and a, a, a good way to literally keep people alive. So it is my pleasure to issue this proclamation, which I'll read. State of South Carolina Governor's Proclamation, whereas one of the most meaningful gifts that a human being can bestow upon another is the gift of life. And whereas more than 108,000 men, women, and children in the United States, including approximately 1,100 residents of South Carolina, await life-saving or life-enhancing organ transplants. And whereas the need for organ, eye, and tissue donation grows daily as a new patient is added to the national waiting list for an organ transplant every 10 minutes, and whereas the critical donor shortage remains a public health crisis, as an average of 22 people die daily due to the lack of available organs, and whereas organ, eye, and tissue donation can provide families the comfort of knowing the gift of donated organs and tissue endows another person with renewed hope for a healthy life, and whereas donating life through organ, eye, and tissue donation is the ultimate act of generosity and kindness we as South Carolina citizens can perform, and whereas Donate Life South Carolina and Sharing Hope South Carolina are the state nonprofit organizations dedicated to promoting awareness about the need for organ and tissue donation. Now, therefore, I, Henry McMaster, governor of the great state of South Carolina, do hereby proclaim April 21, April 2021 as Donate Life Month throughout the state and encourage all South Carolinians to honor all those who make the decision to give the gift of life, work together to raise awareness of the extreme need for organ, eyes, and tissue donations to save the lives of individuals in our state and nation and learn more about the process of becoming an organ donor and sign up on South Carolina's organ and tissue donor registry 
at www.donatelifesc.org. Signed by me, Henry McMaster, proud, happy governor of approximately 5.2 million proud, happy South Carolinians. Ms. Moore. Thank you. Thank you.